about some uh some of the uh popular one piece ships that are out there and seeing like what you guys think about them and we're going to kind of give our opinion on all right so first and foremost is the oro jackson no i'm just kidding not those kind of ships God damn. <laughs> i hate boa hancock and luffy yeah that's that is so dumb mm -hmm. it is cringy it's terrible like they got to be compatible and like clearly luffy has no desire y'all just y'all just enjoy watching luffy get thirsted after because you can like relate put yourself in that place and be like oh yeah that's me but it, no 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 fuck that they Sorry, killed off they killed off the only character God. luffy should have ended up with uta you're getting right into that huh yeah it's fucked up she was such a good character they had to kill her they were like, nah, her her power's too OP. Plus, she got a lot of backstory, and the, you know, now now she she would have a lot of pull on the plot. So let you know, mm. childhood friend of Luffy, kind of a liability when when shit really pops off. Mm -hmm. Like I, I that yeah, makes sense. they killed her off. And she was perfect. She was perfect. She was the perfect fucking person for him. And and Luffy never once punched her. Oh. And Luffy, you know, doesn't care about you know what your gender is or whatever. Like he'll punch you if he feels like you're wrong. And he never once punched Uta. I don't think because he felt like she was wrong. Like he knew she was wrong, but he still, I think, cared about her so much that it was like, I don't care. Like I'm still not gonna hit you. Like that also 100% confirms like he actually had feelings. Not like. Maybe the super romantic stuff, but he definitely cared about her to, like, in in my head canon, more than just a friend. Yeah, I I same same. That's my head canon. I agree with it. I know I know a lot of people really like view Luffy as like the representation for people who are asexual, which, you know, that's cool. That's great. But, you know, if if, if I was to ship Luffy with a character, it would be Uta. Mm -hmm. Or it'd be Nami, mm -hmm. just because she's she can she can deal with his shit. She's one of the few people that can. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I think she can, but she can. And the people who ship Robin with with Luffy, there's something wrong with y'all. Why why are y'all so into like such an older woman being with such a young man? That's a good point. Y'all got mommy issues. Y'all yeah, got problems. Mm -hmm. You feel called out. That's your that's your own problem. <laughs> I'm gonna throw one out there now. I like I understand they identify. You're, you're totally about to show mommy issues, bro. What Zoro and Zoro and Robin? Nah, well, yeah, obviously I shipped that. But I was gonna say, like, you know, there is probably one other person I can, like, again, like it's just based off of how they identify. Yamato yeah, kind of a good match for Luffy. Actually, I, I, I kind of agree with that, but I feel like he would be like, I'm not, I don't like men. You see, like, like Luffy would just take it at face value and be like, I don't like men. You're a man. <laughs> Shit. It, like, valid, like, if it was valid. Sanji, he'd be like, bet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bet that. So, Sanji would be like, be like, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Sanji and Yamato. That makes sense. He needs a strong, powerful woman that, like, you know, it's just a little bit more on that masculine side of, you know, you know, dude. Yamato's the perfect ship for fucking Sanji. It makes so much sense now. And not that 16 year old pudding? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Funny enough, that's like on a Reddit post that I'm looking at right now. <laughs> so is Sanji and Nami. Like, I get it. I get it. And like, trust me, they look good together. Yeah, yeah I get it, but <laughs> that's more of a brother sister dynamic. If I'm yeah. gonna be honest, or like like gay best friend. Yeah. <laughs> 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 if y'all can see the money in my face right now. <laughs> yeah, you know, got that gay best friend energy. Like they walk in and he's like, "Oh my God, you're so fabulous, Nami Swan." <laughs> It's just like, oh, swan. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ooh, that's okay. rough. Poor Sanji. Ship him with Bunkley. Let's be honest. Well, apparently on this list, you know what's on this fucking list? Sanji and Zoro. 
Mm-hmm. I mean, let's be real, bro. Zoro Zoro clearly has attachment issues with women. True. And and he he like he like he's scared. He thinks they're too dainty. He definitely he definitely like respects men a little more. So he probably like looks at men. So he's racist and sexist. Yes, but but you know he probably like looks at a man and is like nice. Hear me a little more often than he, than he does a woman. Hear I can't see the argument. I can sell this more. Okay, that's why Sanji is so so like angry all the time it's like he's hiding his his, his frustration yeah. you know mm-hmm. mm, i get it and see think about this okay zoro sits there and he sees how good sanji is with his feet he ain't ever gonna have to worry about him falling down some stairs oh my god that's why he loves him <laughs> he knows he can get attached because he won't hurt him by falling down the stairs <sighs> wow <sighs> I love that. Perfect I love Zoro that. ship. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Honestly. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Next part. Yeah, yeah. It, it, I hate I'm, to say it. It's fine. Zoro, Zoro, Sanji ship. We'll, we'll, we'll put uh, Robin with with Law. That that's fine. What about Frankie? Ew. Why yeah, you? People people ship that because they're both the two older characters on mm-hmm. the crew. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Like they're around the same age. Like they're even their backstories like coincided. They had like generational people yeah but they have like no sexual chemistry like with zoro and robin what are like, you talking about they actually have some chemistry sexual chemistry yeah with frankie and robin i've never seen that she has straight up that doesn't mean chemistry that just means she manhandled him she assaulted him or maybe assaulted he enjoys him. that he clearly didn't uh, he, I mean, in that moment maybe but maybe you know maybe there's moments the where he's, he's like on the hey. ship and was like you know what I like that. Kind of, like kind of like how you squeezed them. Think about that. it though; they're older, so they're a little bit on me. <laughs> God damn, they're older, they're a little bit more mature. More ages? No, I mean, yeah, obviously, because we not. don't fucking put Sanji okay, with a sixteen-year-old. You know Frankie's mature in the sense that he grasps the situation and is able to empathize with people and like take action, but he is not mature in how he acts. I think just but maybe it's aesthetics a little bit too. Zoro and Robin just aesthetically look better. Yes, they I do. I think that's what my I mean. It is. depends on what you're into. If you're into like, like monster v woman stuff, it, he's a cyborg. He's a robot. Like, you don't know what kind of tendrils he's pulling out. Yeah, I use that word. Hey man, you don't know what she can bust out. I, agreed. That's what I'm saying. The Hanahana no me. Yeah. But, then you, but you think about it. You get this like very loud, you know, flamboyant person. Like, you know, opposites kind of attract. You get Robin. She's quiet, a little bit dark. You know, she's you know, like, obviously, that's, both that's of them. so true. Their, their, their um, sense of senses of humor. Are you fucking kidding me? And they're both. Like he's old enough to like get creative. it. Mm-hmm. And, and they're both book smart. Facts. Low key, low key. I hate to say, but I kind of, I kind of gotta give some more points to that. I, I'm, I'm not a fan of the ship, but I, I, I can see I why it. people justify it. I get it. Plus, they're both, you know, traumatized by Cyberpol. Oh my god, yeah, the government, <laughs> the government is fucking traumatized them both. <laughs> um, <laughs> damn, really I'm like sorry, no, I'm just thinking about Robin freaking out. For a buster call, the rest of the crew is just like, okay. Cool. And she's like, oh, God. <laughs> I'm terrible for laughing about it, I know, but it's so funny. That meme. Oh, my. F- I'm uh, going to just post it a ton of times. 